As Nigeria continues to mourn the late Chief of Army Staff Lieutenant General Ibrahim Atahiru and 10 other soldiers who died in the ill fated air crash in Kaduna on the 21st of May 2021 and buried at the National Military Cemetery Abuja on the 22nd of May 2021. The Chief of Defence Staff, Major General Loki Urabo, has charged officers of the armed forces to remain steadfast in the fight against insecurity. Major General Irabo made the statement while speaking to newsmen at the third day fidel prayers in honor of the late soldiers at the staff flag house in Naja Barracks, Abuja. I admonished every officer and personnel of the armed forces to take courage, to rise in faith, and that remains what I still give to them. This is only but for a moment. We are not undaunted in any way. Our spirit remains unmovable, unshakable, and I like every officer and personnel of the armed forces to remain steadfast because that which we desire to achieve by way of protecting lives and properties of all Nigerians in line with our personal mandates will be achieved. While at the prayer session, the Director of Islamic Affairs of the Nigerian Army, Brigadier General Shehu Gaba Mustafa, said it is needful to seek Allah's forgiveness on behalf of the late Chief of Staff and his entourage. Well, the prayer implies that after three days with the demise of our late Chief of Army Staff and his entourage, so uh, we gather here to pray for him and his entourage, seeking Allah's uh, forgiveness for him and his entourage. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant them entrance into paradise. And we also pray for their families, for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to continue to be with them and guide them, protect them anywhere they may find themselves. We also pray. We see use the opportunity today for our leaders at all levels. May Allah continue to guide them and bless them with divine guidance and wisdom in moving this country forward. Thank you very much. President Muhammad Buhari also ordered that the national flag be flown at half mast in all public buildings, facilities, and official residences from May 24, 2021 to Wednesday, May 26, 2021, in honor of the late soldiers.